on the chapter trees. First, we see few characterization of trees. The definition of tree is a graph which is a cyclic and connected is called tree. Okay. First, a graph is a cyclic. When a graph is cyclic, if suppose the starting point and the terminus, the terminus point both are similar, then it is called as a cyclic graph. This is an example of cyclic graph. As earlier what we have seen, the definition of cyclic graph. If the starting point and the terminus, terminus point both are similar, then it is called as a cyclic graph. Now, a cyclic graph, if the starting point and the terminus point are not equal, then it is said as a cyclic graph. This is an example of a cyclic graph. Now, the condition for the tree is a cyclic graph as well as connected graph. When a graph is connected, already we have seen in previous, if there is a path from the first point to the last point without any disconnecting points. If you have a path from first point to the last point, then it is called a connector. Here we see, is it the graph is acyclic? A cyclic graph. This graph is acyclic because the starting point and terminus points are different. And another one condition is connected. This graph is connected because still we have a path between U and V. This graph is called T because it satisfied both the condition a cyclic as well as connected. connected. Now we go for the definition of forest. If a tree, suppose this is a tree, if we have one or more tree, suppose we have one or more tree, more than one tree in a graph, then this graph is called as forest. You see, this is one of component. This is one another component. This is one another component. Each and every component is a tree. This is a tree. This is a tree. This is a tree. Okay. If suppose we have more than one tree in a graph, then it is called as a forest. So far, what we have learned in the characterization is the definition of tree. In this definition of tree, we need two conditions to satisfy. One is acyclic, another one is connected. And if we have more than one tree, then it is called a forest. forest. 